Yo, what is good, everybody? Welcome back to another video. Hopefully, you guys are having an awesome day filled with only positive vibes. Today, we're going to give you guys a Gunsmith HBR video. To be honest, I don't remember exactly what build I went with, but I wanted to show you guys that the HBR is not going to be as amazing as people might think. It did get a damage nerf, but this is all going to be stream highlights. So if you want to watch me live on stream, trovo.live slash the hitman, you guys will be able to watch me every single night. Make sure to follow me. It's going to be the first pinned comment. But anyway, guys, hopefully, you guys enjoyed the rest of the video, and I'll see you guys at the so when it comes to this it doesn't have any crazy abilities when it comes to like that it doesn't have like a crazy fast like grip and i don't think it has you can do the no grip or the skeleton stock so i think potentially we're gonna try a very fast mobility kind of build so we go with the no stock lose out on vertical recoil i think there's a barrel that gives you the speed as well i don't have the barrel though so you can't go with the movement speed so you kind of have to go like a you can kind of try the fast ads build so We'll potentially try the fast ADS build with the skeleton stock. We go with obviously the laser. Um, I think there's a barrel that will give us a damage range with a little bit of lateral vertical recoil. Honestly, I'd much rather have lateral recoil because I believe it has a bit of lateral recoil. Recoil. Hawksnest.gg, just let you guys know. That's the site I'm using right now. For those who didn't know, for the hundredth billion time I've said it. The damage right now is currently 26, 22, 17. I believe it got reduced. Oh, it has like no vert. It has a little bit. So we'll go with this. And then we go with the, we go with the kind of long shot build. I heard it nerfed the HBR and we can kind of go with the silence build here, but damage range, you don't really lose much. So we still have that, that ADS and moving speed build. So, all right. Save that bad boy. I like this build. We'll try it out. I don't like the iron sight. I'm gonna be real with you guys. I do not like the iron sight. Not even close. All right, base HBR, iron sight, a usual, uh, pretty poo poo. Damage test, 26 damage, and a 10. I believe it's 22, which uh, it looked like it might have been nerfed. Yes, slight nerf. Currently at. We can actually even test it even better. So if we do the little button here, so up to how long does it go 26? 10 meter, 10 meters, still 26. I'm at 12 meters here. Okay. So it looks like at 22 meters. Yeah. So at 10 meters, it's, it's a slight nerf. Currently it's up till 13 meters and then it's still 22 meters. Again, recoil is, uh, not not that bad it's really manageable a little bit of lateral recoil near the end part but i think the important part is that long range shot which is 16 damage oh it's 17 damage yeah so again time to kill close range is really really good now we're gonna switch to the other class all right so the scoping time is i don't know how much worse it is it's this is pretty fast but if we go to the other class I, I think we lose out a little bit of ADS, which is not bad, all things considered. And then at that range, it's silenced, 16 damage still. It's more like that 20 damage range. Let's see if it got increased enough range. 22 damage. Might not be accurate, to be honest with you guys. But the recoil control, though, might be pretty nice. You won't be able to tell until you're in-game, honestly. If oh, I can actually probably hop on a second account to kind of test it because it doesn't really show you as much. There's obviously going to be a bunch of bots. Enemy taking A. Enemy has A. All right, let me just, we let me see. C. We captured Charlie. We captured B. UAV recon is standing by. Repeat, UAV recon is standing by. Oh, whoop. The hip fire is actually pretty good. By the way, by the way, look, that hip fire is really, really tight, by the way. That hip fire is really tight. Oh, I have nine bullets. Oh, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm gonna UAV. I want to get like long shots. I want to see if I'm able to kill these. Okay. 
One, two, three. Looks like a four tap even at that range. So that's actually pretty good. I'm just gonna finish capping this. Thank you. Wait, okay, let's see this guy walking in if I can kill him for a shot. That looks like a four shot to me. That looks like a four shot to me. That's kind of crazy, the fact that it has pretty insane range. I'm actually curious to see if I can... Alright. The HVR is still going to be really good. If you go like a... It's not even a, it's not even a no recoil build. It's Like I said, it's not even a no recoil build. It's really... Bro. What the heck was that? What the heck was that? The heck was that? <laughs> HBR ranked. I don't know. It, see, the, like the thing is, like my mobility is pretty good. Obviously, my my iron sight's really bad. However, I feel like for like a long range map, I feel like I'm gonna try this on crossfire and see how it goes. So we're actually gonna quit because obviously it was pretty nice. But if I go on like crossfire, which is like a longer range kind of map. It'll give you a more rough estimate. I did it on purpose so we can have the fast ADS kind of build. All right, so let's build a fast ADS kind of build. So on paper, ADS speed here. Um, I think there was a barrel ADS speed as well. There was definitely a stock that gave you moon speed and ADS speed, which I believe was... I think we just go with the... Um, I'm curious to see how much you actually ADS more. It doesn't really tell you how much more. Increased mobility but poor accuracy, yeah? What about this? Detached stock, maximum ability, but accuracy will be hard to maintain. But what's the difference between this one? I feel like we'll just stick with this one. And then is there an ADS speed here? The sprint in speed and ADS speed. I don't think this one has ADS speed. This actually matter of fact reduces your ADS speed and there might be a muzzle that increases your ADS speed, but I doubt it. Yeah. So when it comes to that, ammo, fast mag, 44 bullets, optics. I mean, I think the optics reduces your ADS speed, so it doesn't really help. And then muzzle, I, I just went with it. Under barrel, nope. We'll just go with a perk that just increases your, um, your slight of hand was pretty good, but we're gonna go with long shot. Just increase that 10%. Honestly, a muzzle could have been nice too, the monolithic suppression, but I don't wanna lose out the ADS speed, so we're gonna save this as our fast ADS speed build. Actually, you know what? We'll go with the ADS first because I want to get my first impressions of the ADS. So, we'll be able to have the fast mobility. But then again, I feel like other ARs will have better advantage when it comes to like fast ADS and fast... See, that ADS is not even that crazy. It's good, but like, is it that crazy? Capture the objectives. We're capturing C. We are pretty and fast though. Desync, I love it. Okay, that's pretty nice. Lol. I'm not gonna lie, the fast ADS kind of build is kind of nutty. Like, if you want to go fast ADS speed... I'm getting shot in the back. Good thing for a 4 tap potential chat, am I right? Oh, I got snipped. The thing is, like, why use this one if I can use a KN? You know what I mean? The KN will have better rate of fire, better mobility. I just almost, he almost suicided in me. The thing is, I'm using a better gun. He's just sniping out here. Reloading. Yeah, the fast ADS is, is fast, but is it as fast as, like, an SMG build that you can go? You know what I mean? Be advised, hostile hunter killer down. There you go, let's get this guy here. I'm dead. Oh, first half, all right. Nice work. The RH is probably better, of course. Round. All right, so we're gonna do like a long range map. Like this is the long range build. You can see the ADS is not that bad, but we should be able to laser people pretty, pretty much from like that medium to long range. HVR can still be potentially still good. Wait, hold on. We're gonna try this guy here. Looks like a... Where's this guy? Is 
that four tap potential from like that medium to long range is actually insane. I don't know. The thing is that you can you your time to kill is pretty insane, even despite not having that crazy ADS. Ouch. Right? Oh, wait, I'm glitched. Stop firing. Get the S6 and see how it is. I just got sniped by Radiant Dan. We lost B, oh no. Oh, I got sniped by Radiant Dan. To be honest, the more they cap, the more I can try out. Radiant Dan's a bot. Oh, we just won. Yeah, I think the fast ADS build is a little bit better too. But a fast ADS build is gonna be better for most builds. It's just it's not worth it for the HBR to use it. So here's my thing, all right? So there's some guns that take advantage of the long range build, which is gonna be like those lower ranks. Not lower rank, lower rate of fire kind of gun. All right, that's it for today. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, like, share, and subscribe. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys think about the HBR. I have a few more videos I can post, but probably gonna drop the GKS if it is not released tomorrow. If the Gunsmith are released, I'm just gonna drop the Gunsmith video and then we're gonna work with that. But the HBR is probably the most requested. I might even drop a second video before, but we'll see how it goes. But hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. All right, I'm out. See you guys next time. Kill it.